Hi there, I'm Professor Joe Romani, a professor of consulting at Cardiff University, and I've been helping boutique consultancies grow and their founders exit for the last 23 years now. Um, one of the most common things I've seen in consultancies that restrict their growth is a dependency on founders or the CEO or the partners, um, senior partners, for uh, sales. And this often creates a bottleneck of growth, typically around the 20 to 30 person mark when it comes to uh, employees um, and this is very often because um, new partners or junior partners or directors are having trouble stepping up into that new role so they've typically been uh, focused on delivery um, and the the minutiae of managing teams and now they have to step up to sell to build trusted relationships and to almost change the the relationship that they have with clients and this can create a whole load of problems so you have the the founder bottleneck which reduces the value of the firm because the the firm is is intrinsically seen as entwined with the owners of the firm um, and that's a problem if people are buying firms it limits growth uh, in terms of revenue but it also limits margin um, because you're not necessarily selling the right type of stuff and it also affects you know partner motivation or director motivation in terms of they're perhaps not doing the job that they have been asked to do and are being are getting quite frustrated uh, with it and of course the owner or uh, seniors in the firm will be get, getting frustrated with them because they're not hitting their growth targets so this is quite a common I'd say it's it's in the top three um, common challenges of boutique consulting firms above 20, 15 to 20 employees. Um, but I've seen it in firms of 100 plus as well. Um, typically, they will have three or four partners or founders of the firm, but literally all of the client contacts will be coming from them and most of the business development effort will be coming from them, which really restrict their ability to exit the firm, but also for firm growth. So what I've done, and this has really been going on for 20 years or so, so with my professor hat on, I uh, research what works. So it's a very low bullshit uh, approach to business development um, based around based on evidence, and there's good insights from all over there. So there's good, good insights. You know, David Meister, 30 years ago, um, had some fantastic insights on building relationships, long-term relationships with senior clients, but also there's been more recent stuff around the activator, approach to sales or the challenger approach to sales or um, value-based selling. So I've accumulated all of that, those different approaches to evidencing what works and put them into this program, but also based on my own experience over the last 20 odd years of dealing with growth and exit in professional service firms. So this, uh, this training program is really the culmination of all of that. Um, and um, it, what I've done here is I've put it all online. It can also be del delivered virtually by me and also delivered face to face by me. So if you want if you want those approaches, do please have a look. Um, it's obviously better face to face. Um, and I would also recommend, you know, if you are thinking about doing this training or any business development training to add in some coaching, because a lot of the evidence shows that sort of standalone um, training, you know, in, in an almost classroom environment doesn't tend to stick. So I would also um, uh, suggest having some coaching. If you're doing the face to face or the virtual approach, I've also got a benchmarking questionnaire where I can benchmark the strengths and weaknesses of your senior team in terms of business development. The program itself goes through four things. It looks at building long term trusted relationships with senior clients. It focuses on account development skills. Um, sort of developing within the same clients. It looks at different sales techniques and how those can be used for your firms. And then it helps build the visible expertise, so the visibility of the partners to potential leads and your target clients. Um, and within that, there's a series of exercises that I've developed myself um, that have been tried and, tried and tested over the years. So if you're thinking about it, do give me a shout. I get happy to put you in contact with people who have done the program and it's worked for. Um, and let's get some of those partners stepping up to, um, to get more sales and better margins. All right, take care. Bye-bye.